can see, I'm currently in my tack room. Now, I've seen a lot of videos going around YouTube and also like Instagram. Everyone is doing like spring cleans ups, some painting, and I just really wanted to get involved with it. So as you can see, this is my tack room and I'm quite known for my shelf. So I wanted to give it a little bit of a DIY and a little bit of DIY around the stables. I've got my dad here to help me today with a few drill drilling jobs. So we're gonna get everything off here, give it a bit of a paint. We've got all different paints here. We're gonna do some mixing because we haven't got the colors that we want. So we're gonna have to do a bit of mixing and kind of go with what we've got. So I really hope you enjoy this video. So let's get on with it. So as you can see, we've got a lot of stuff on here. So we need to get that off first so we can get start to painting. As you can see, it's just gone really like manky. Um, last time I painted it was in July when we um, moved over here. So let's get um, taking these off. Okay, so as you can see, it looks so bare. I haven't seen it this bare since um, my dad put it up for me. So it looks really crazy. As you can see, all the paints come off uh, and it's got a little bit moldy up there. Uh, but we need to sweep it off first because there is a bit of food. So, yeah. here um me and my mom kind of had a look through uh, so i don't know if the paints have gone out of date or <laughs> what's going on in here so we've got a little rag we've got a few paint brushes okay so we've got a little blue because we are going to be painting the horseshoes uh, we've got some red got a bit of yellow uh, i think this is like a mini green which is quite nice and then like a natural beige color so we've got yellow and then we've got which is this colour. So we do some painting. And also we've got something here that we're gonna save for a bit later on in the video. Whoops. Yeah. <laughs> so we've got the paint here. I just had to make sure that it was the right um colour. So we're gonna start from the top down to the bottom. So let's go. this area and then looked how dirty it was it's super satisfying so now we're going to go head into like the main yard bit and um, we're going to do a bit of painting in there mixing some paints um hopefully they do turn out all right i don't know if the 
okay if they're a bit gone off but we'll find out um and then we're going to do some other stuff so let's head to the yard see we're now in the yard area and we have a few paints here uh, we're going to give them a little shake but as you can see these are the horses horseshoes um and again they got put up in july and they've got a little bit like kind of rotten now so i'm going to give them a bit of a paint but before we do that we need to give these paints a bit of a shake so So ready so let's get to painting so we are outside the stables now as you can see i've got a really snazzy painting outfit so i've got this that we're just going to mix the paint in because this is actually the same blue which is used on diesels so that's had a nice little shape but we're gonna have to mix the pink so i'm gonna put a bit of red in wow that's not even it needs a little bit that's probably a bit too much i don't know if that's a bit too much I don't know, we'll, we'll go with it. Okay, then I'm gonna put this in. This isn't white, but it's similar. <laughs> tap room sign as you can see it's super cool i just had no time and i don't know where to put it and i thought what a cool idea to put it in this video so i won't be putting it up my dad will uh, so i thought because we're doing diys and painting let's put it up so let's head to the tap room to screw this in
so as you can see it's been about an hour now and the paint is dry so we're going to put everything back and in that hour I did a little bit of um, painting which you would have saw earlier and I also cleaned the floor so it's time to put everything back on the shelf so a little bit of a time lapse. So I just want to take you around and just show you a bit of it. So um, we put everything back to normal. You can see like before, this was just so horrible and rotten and it definitely did need a bit of a paint. Some of these kiln jars were empty so I just filled them up with a few things I could find because I can't get to the shop just yet. Um, so we just tidied it all out, we've cleaned all the buckets out, we've got all the flies to fall out. Then um, I found this back out the uh, cook sex Lincoln little sign so I made that myself um so we've just cleaned everything out could possibly and I've also scrubbed the floor I literally just was scrubbing it I mentioned it earlier I completely scrubbed all the mats and everything so I'm super proud of myself that I tidied it so as you can see I'm back now and I'm like all in my horsey riding gear um, I'm gonna put my job boots on I think I've left them in the car I don't know um and then I'm gonna tap these look I found some new reins because um as you all know my reins did snap so I've been having to use some brown ones uh from like previous horses um I've rode so I finally found some black rubber reins I can use tonight so I don't know what we're gonna do if we're gonna do some jumping trotting poles anything like that so I'm excited to get diesel in tack him up and jump over the new jumps <laughs> so let's go So there's mousies, there's probably not a huge difference, but if you 
did look before that one was much darker this is still the same color he wants his treats though because he's been such a good boy tonight so i really hope you did enjoy this video and make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel mouse uh subscribe to my youtube channel and also check out my instagram which is Ali May sources stay safe see you next time and stay boss bye <laughs>